Hello everyone, my name is Henry Lee, blueheronarts.com. Now I'm at uh, my home studio to show you a process of creating a Hangul Korean name seal for Mr. Son Son. <laughs> I wish I made uh, uh, understandable. Uh, actually, he is behind the camera today with me uh, watching this process, and I like to show other Korean friends, if you want to create a personal seal like uh, Mr. Son, um, you can do this as a following. First of all, I need to have a um, hand-drawn uh, des design with the Korean alphabets or letters uh, of your name. Um, he wrote me with this to begin with, with just a ball pen, and I used this thick marker felt pen to broaden it, and he likes it. And we keep on some other um, possibilities. He wrote, uh, you know, more, some more in a script or uh, print style, or some more style, you know, design of uh, play with the spacing. And we like this one the best. I show you, I draw the border, but he he did the, the middle. I call this a signature mark chop. So I want to have this handwriting, uh, the kind of uh, feel. So it's more organic, uh, natural than uh, like a print. Uh, this is the mirror image, and he tried to reproduce that on the seal. It's kind of a challenge to do the mirror image, so I don't require you to do that. Just write in a natural way, and I can flip it on the computer. Here's what I did. Okay, um, this is still the the normal way, but I will flip it on the on the stone. Uh, so let me erase this first, so we can do that transfer. So I erase this draft. Now I take a stamp or coupon because I made multiple uh, stamps uh, in case I may fail. Uh, so I flip this on. So it will be a, a stamp imprint on the on the stone with this chemical <coughs> called the uh, acetone. It's a nail polish remover you get from. Um, cosmetic supply stores, acetone, pure acetone with no scent or anything else. <clears throat> Just put on the back of the paper and uh, press. Okay, one trick is uh, very important. This has to be uh, not a handwriting, it has to be the um, <coughs> Laser jet, laser jet uh, uh, copy. Okay, I think I can read it. If not, I can enhance it with the marker pen. Uh, I think it's pretty clear. Yes, it's okay. pretty good. Okay, so I'm going to work on this. But the best part of this is 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 a uh, waterproof. Uh, you 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 won't get. Uh, uh, Bleed when you get you know sweater from your hand or something. Um, so it's very, very uh, permanent. <laughs> Not really permanent. It's very stable to um, work with. So I can I can rub it without to worry about erasing anything. Um, you can see the designs are slightly smaller than the one inch stone because that give me uh, room to make this uh, nice. H, nice uh, shape. We don't make it perfect square because it's too mechanic. You know, we want to make it more like an ancient, ancient seal. So we cut out the shape first. It's a kind of a, uh, physical <laughs> now, <laughs> but the, before it was a brainstorm, brain work. Yeah. Okay. 
I would use a stone cutter. Yeah, it's a it's a very um, you know it, when when I finish, I my jar would be locked, mm -hmm. like <laughs> cannot chew because mm -hmm. you have you use a lot of energy to cut. very precise. This is like calligraphy, no, no repeat <laughs> one stroke, every stroke counts. <coughs> to make the seal looks uh, very natural, uh, like an old seal. Yeah. Also, it's an authenticity measure. You know, it's, uh, for make it uh, not non uh, duplicable, mm -hmm. because uh, in the past, the, if you don't have computer, you know, it's hard to duplicate all this chipping. Almost impossible to duplicate. That's why we use this on the artwork to uh, authenticate or just like you know, certificate. Circle in Korean alphabet is very unique. Um, normally, we have a square in Chinese. Is it much simpler than Chinese characters? Um, it's difficult to, to do the circle. It's like <laughs> the anzol. <laughs> you know, it's I where see. you have to be uh, round, but not exactly round. It's a, it's a, it's a very different. Well, we have this circle in. Our sales script, yeah. uh, I think, yeah, some cursive stroke right. like that. But uh, in the sales script, uh, square lines the more uh, than the, the the writing in the writing, yes, on the seal. So it, it's uh, it's rare to do the circle. I think, yeah.
think that your writing is very artistic. You're a calligrapher, right? This is, uh, I can feel <coughs> the the chi, the energy uh -huh. in, in your stroke. It helps. I'm not an expert, I'm a novice, I'm mm -hmm. still learning. I, I really like to try more, but mm. yeah, I think uh, not enough time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we are our amateur artists to start mm -hmm. with. Yeah. Fun, fine tweet. Oops. Yeah, I was an uh, uh, archaeologist mm -hmm. in China. I studied uh, Chinese uh, uh, historical archaeology, especially in the uh, Han period. Mm -hmm. That's where the this script, uh, Han script, mm -hmm. is uh, used in uh, official and private uh, uh, seals. Mm -hmm. And I, uh, I have uh, participated in some excavations, you know, digging of tombs, mm -hmm. so to speak. And uh, some tombs uh, are, you know, belong to the Han royal f uh, imperial family. Yes. Uh, we have found uh, seals made of bronze and jade and uh, even gold. Mm -hmm. uh, I made the rubbings of those. I played with that. So I'm very familiar with this uh, uh, this writing system and mm -hmm. the feel, you know, the, the of it. Uh, that's very important in. Uh, this antiquarian, uh, antiquarian art. Uh, so we try to reproduce the kind of uh, bronze or, or stone seal um, with this antique uh, look and feel. Uh, so my background in archaeology really helped. Uh, so I don't like the mechanic uh, modern uh, font, you know, like a computer font. Uh, you can generate it on the computer, uh, I mean on the internet, many websites provide this kind of like, program. Uh, they use, uh, so, you know, the, the everybody is the same. There's no life, vitality in it. Uh, the ancient script, um, they, it has the kind of originality that's uh, very uh, different. So I, I'm also a painter and calligrapher. Mm -hmm. um, I teach Chinese brush painting online as my full-time job, mm -hmm. and I sell supplies uh, to them, including the seal engraving art supplies mm -hmm. and a service. Mm -hmm. So you can get the stone, the, the, the carving tool um, at our website, Blue Heron Arts. Um, yeah. I've been doing this for 40 years. Last year, we had a, I had an artist in resident and a, a retrospective in Wisconsin, mm -hmm. uh, University of Wisconsin. Uh, so Why University of Wisconsin? What's the connection with that? Oh, they just found me on the internet, and mm -hmm. they have the a professor who's uh, uh, now teaching a word class, uh, a word art class, mm -hmm. art, word, word art history class, yes. I think. Uh, so that's why, uh, and she's still teaching that class with uh, uh, my online, uh, Lessons. So I have like uh, 400 or 50, uh, 500 uh, students online, and I have like uh, 
30,000 followers on YouTube or something like that. Yeah, about four, five thousand, five thousand maybe subscriptions. Um, okay, so I'm going to uh, make initial imprint to see how it look, and we have, may have to keep fine tuning until we feel uh, satisfied. Oops, I made a mistake. Um, <laughs> last, it, uh, last touch. We let's can do see. A fine tuning, no? Yeah, let's see. If uh, something wrong, we have to erase it mm -hmm. um, to see uh, how it looks. Okay, just. Yeah, uh, let's just make some more chipping, so it will it, it will balance <laughs> the whole thing, mm -hmm. just like uh, random, mm -hmm. you know, make it uh, look like look like random. Okay. Okay. So this is a so I I have some desire, but I have no control on on this kind of uh, locking, mm -hmm. but it would be very interesting to see what is coming up. Let me get a piece of paper towel. Yes. Okay, um, let's make an initial imprint. Put on this side by side. Uh, so because the stone is hard, we need to put uh, uh, some soft under it. On the uh, yeah, on the bottom. You can use a book or something. What kind of ink is that? Yeah. Okay. It's a um, oil-based okay. cinnabar. Uh, they call it a cinnabar, but actually yeah. pigments. Um, uh, it has kind of special fiber made from uh, uh, flax. Of a re special reed, mm -hmm. uh, so it's very fine. One one stick in the uh, stroke. Yes. Uh, yeah, that's good. You can press and just like roll a little bit, but not moving. Mm -hmm. uh, hold the paper down like that. Yes. When you lift, it, it's sticky. Yeah. Right. So you see that's a looks really good. Yeah, then we just do a little adjustment. Okay, so... Uh, Can you read some, that? Yes, of course. Uh, there's a... There, uh, the tone is darker and lighter. Oh, okay. Uh, that's a, I think that's the beauty uh, of the uh, music. Okay, I, I think that that's uh, just... Each imprint is different, mm -hmm. so yeah, we can try make it more solid, less granny. Yeah, uh, because the ink is kind of dry, I need to change new ink. I, see, I, see. Um, I think it should be... So the stroke is all readable, right? With some yeah, uh, chipping. It is, it is. Okay. There's a, like a fine tuning, yeah, like here, uh -huh. give a more line okay, here, okay. give a more line here, give a more uh, okay. deeper so that it, it gives a more like pop out only letter, huh? Okay. Yeah. I think it, some connection of that is desired. Oh, I see. It's a, it's a kind of a, yeah, it's desired. I, some, see, I, see. So I can open some. We can... Um, and I like this one, you know. This yeah, is yeah. A, like uh, uh, the bottom syllable. Yeah. Uh, consonant, actually. Yeah. Consonant and uh, there's a, uh, the sidebar mm -hmm. has a little room. Yeah. Very fine uh, yeah. detail yeah. room. Yeah. Uh, I like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's dense, but uh, yes. uh, still, dense. yeah. Okay, so that's good. Um, glad that worked out. Good. I can make it a... Oh, a little mm -hmm. yeah. clear. Oh, and yeah, make it more pop out. Yeah. Okay, so yes. maybe I just take this out. 
as designed, I think that would be good. So you have only one knife. Oh, just I have doing this, it, or yeah, I have. Fine I have yeah, I have like a little one, okay. but we don't need uh, so so fine one. Yeah. This is good enough, because yeah. this stroke is relatively thick than I normally do. Okay, <laughs> okay uh, I think it's good. Looks good. Let me try one more time without uh, too much grain. Maybe uh, I'll show you the trick also. So first of all, you need to uh, load very evenly. So because the this uh, paste Pigment is uh, yeah, it's not uh, even, even right. because I, I have used the half of it. It, right, it consumed. Right, right, uh, right. I, I have to do a corner at a time. Right. So just make sure you can check to see if any missing spot. And blow some and moisture, yeah, moisture, from the yeah. from the. It was uh, help to soften uh, in the winter, you know. Mm -hmm. But here at least to give some more moisture to that. So you can press really hard yes. and uh, kind of roll a little bit, not moving, just wave a little bit. It will help to get the grain, less grain, but more mm -hmm. solid. Yes. Uh, I can yes. do better with a uh, different paper, maybe. Um, so, pretty good. good. I think this you is, uh, yeah, okay. is uh, very nice. Okay. Yeah, let's uh, just uh, clean up the, the edge on top. Mm -hmm. Maybe that's uh, all I need to do. Just do uh, this. Thing. Make this uh, slope a little steeper. So you, when you wave, you might get thicker border. I That's see, what happens. I see, I see. When you when you when you the, if the you go just straight down, uh, you, you you can keep the shape yeah. um, original. But if you wave, you will get more right. on the, because the uh, seal is not uh, uh, just two dimension. It's a relief, exactly. so to speak. Yeah. If you press more, it will thicker. It will press less. It will be. Thinner too. Mm -hmm. So uh, maybe just. Uh, so you already feel that the fine tuning is over. Um, I kind of like the happy accident <laughs> we had, and then yeah. the chopping. So okay. it's. Uh, um, let me let me try one more time. Just to make sure you like it uh, before you you take home. Mm -hmm. so, do another. Let me just make it more solid. Yeah. Yeah, so I do it about uh, like a dozen times. Mm -hmm. and very hard press and to lift very gently. Oops, I think I got uh, mm -hmm. in the wrong direction. Mm -hmm. Okay, Here, here's what uh, I would do. I will sign the, the uh, carving on the side. So mm -hmm. um, usually I sign my name on the left side. I when you hold it. So it would be on, on the left side. Okay. And then you know the orientation. You I won't see. make such a yes. mistake on your, on your, yeah. on your artwork. Yes. So let me just do my, uh, I would, I would just simply put my Chinese name, Xiao mm -hmm. Hui. Uh, Xiao means morning. Mm -hmm. Is that Gong? Uh, Xiao. Xiao means the Chinese name. Xiao means morning. morning. Yeah, many Chinese names with this sound. Oh. It sounds like a small, but uh, not as the, uh, the pronunciation is like a little, uh, but actually. Xiao. Xiao, yeah. Hui means uh, sunshine or light. Mm -hmm. yeah. Sunshine, yeah. Nice. Morning sunshine. Mm -hmm. <coughs> OK. 
Okay. Or just a simple name. You can put another verb, like a carved or made or something. I, I just omit that. Um, <coughs> so, let's see. So we uh, do another imprint on the left side so you can compare with the. Mm -hmm. Just do one more. Yeah, you need to maybe uh, get a. Did you have this at home? Uh, no. No? Okay, yeah, okay, we'll talk about it later. Um, so this is going to be the last, uh, trial, right? I hope, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll one. give, uh, I have to make an official okay. on my, uh, I have a book to okay. collect all the mm -hmm. final mm -hmm. copies. This, this is draft will mm -hmm. be the last, I think. Yeah, normally, I <coughs> yeah, so you, you can look at it if you want to change anything. Good. Okay. Good. Yeah, uh, I think uh, that's good. I think it's a very powerful design. Yeah. So since I'm uh, already brought my calligraphy, uh, I want to just uh, stamp right there. Oh, okay. Uh, you before I put together. Okay. Or we'll do that uh, on on the large table, yeah. right? It's a large piece. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Uh, canvas. Let me make a make a seal in my collection book. Mm -hmm. This is my official copy, mm -hmm. and I normally give you with the box to to right. keep it uh, to keep it in the box. Yes. So I will make another one. Yes. Um, let me just put it here. Ran out of the cards. Mm -hmm. Hope I make. <laughs> so this is uh, on the left. Okay. Soft background. Yeah, I, I have this. Uh, put this on under it. Under it. Yeah. This one. Mm -hmm. That's good. Yeah. And then, uh, what about the ink? Would you put the ink? Yeah. Or should I put the ink? Yeah, let me do that. Okay. So, I already put underneath. Okay. Where Where do you want to? Just the below in the middle. Mm -hmm. Just the below in the middle. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is a canvas, so it's it kind of canvas. A, yeah, that's kind of a, you will see brands. Yes. Yeah. A little challenge, you know. Yeah. Can you move? Uh, let me move that uh, here so people can see. Okay. Yes. okay.
uh, if you um, hold on. If you uh, use just l uh, let me explain. If you use uh, like a this a kind of canvas, yeah, this canvas or watercolor, I think there's no prime on it. It's just the raw canvas. Okay. Well, actually, on okay. the prime, you find there is a prime. Oh, the yeah. Prime. Oh. yeah. If if it's absorbent, you can water it. it right. Sometimes it helps exactly. with the moisture on the on the canvas. Okay. Okay. Soften so the. Make sure where is the front? Is that yeah, the, front? the front? That yeah. does the front. Yeah. yeah. Right below, mm -hmm. right here, right there, yeah. Don't kind of fall. <laughs> that's <laughs> first that's what's step. challenging. Yeah. You want to hold it with your left hand, like right, this. Right. Just, <laughs> just I try to <laughs> press the uh -huh. the uh -huh. fiber right, flat. Right. I'm not sure if we're we made it, but this is the hardest I can do. Oh, that's good. Good? Very good. <laughs> it's kind of granny, but... Uh, yeah, it is. Yeah. It is a, a little light, but yeah. hmm, I think that's the best. Yeah. If we use a more uh, you can try brand new... Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Then might be better. But right, uh, yeah. My, my ink is a little dry. Okay. That's, that's for sure. Okay. We cannot repeat again because it's original. Um, you can repeat with a, a guide. We sell a, like a straight, uh, kind of oh, like a corner. Uh, yes, you yes. can you can repeat that. Uh, but you need a special tool like a, a, a right. uh, ruler. Exactly. Yeah. I think this is good. Okay, very good. Okay, thanks for watching, everybody. See you next time. Contact me at blueheronarts.com if you need uh, to uh, commission me doing your own sale. Thanks for watching.